you've been running ads and posting content and sending emails and doing pretty much every e-commerce trick in the book at your store, still is growing way too slow. I wanna let you in on a little strategy that some of the fastest growing e-commerce stores are using. And it's not a brand new AI tool or some crazy Facebook creative strategy that you need to know about. It's a super simple strategy that gets other people to promote your brand for you so you're not doing all the work. And the best thing is, it takes about 10 minutes to set up. So in this video, I wanna show you step-by-step step exactly how to set this strategy up on your Shopify store and how to find the people to promote your business for you. You don't need to pay up front. You're not gonna need a big team and you're not gonna need a tech degree to install it. The strategy that I'm gonna teach you today is affiliate marketing for Shopify, but it's not the spammy kind or the complicated setup with all the sort of levels. It's a super simple, clean setup so that when someone refers a sale to you, they earn a small commission. It's low risk and high leverage, which means you're not gonna be burning money on ads and you can use this to scale fast. So let me show you how to set this up. Now the app we're gonna be using is called Up Promote. I have tried so many Shopify affiliate apps and this is by far my favorite. It's the easiest to use, it has the most features. The free plan is absolutely awesome if you're just starting out. So I've got a link to Up Promote down below directly to the Shopify app store. So make sure you grab that. And then when you're ready, click install. Now we're gonna take you through two demos or two tutorials here. The first one is I'm gonna take you through how to set it up on a store from scratch. And then I'm gonna show you how it's working on one of my more established stores. So let's click install and then we'll bring you to the overview screen. So the way this app works is we create a program and that program we enroll people into and they're called our affiliates. And what these affiliates do is they go out and promote your store to the world, to their friends, to whoever they want. And if the people they promote it to come to your store and buy something from you, you give a kickback to that affiliate, right? So that could be whatever you want it to be. As long as they drive you a sale, you reward them for it, okay? So it's a bit like a, a sales commission that you give them. So we're gonna set up a program for them to enroll in and decide all the rules around that. Then we're gonna work out a way to pay them and then we're gonna work out a way to outreach them. And then I'm gonna show you sort of how it all works in the back end. So let's get into that now. First, we're gonna create the program. So let's click programs first and we'll click add program. So we're gonna use this to reward our content creators so they can put their link out there and earn commissions on all the content they put out in the world. So I'll call it the creator program. I'm gonna enable the program. Uh, we could write a little description in here. This is for our creators, excellent. And then this is where we determine how much we wanna pay these affiliates. So this is the commission structure. We have two types. We have a simple one, which is like a fixed commission. And then we have an advanced one, which is you know based on the order value. I prefer keeping things super simple. So we're gonna choose the simple one and we're gonna choose whether or not we want it to be a percentage of sale, flat rate per item or a flat rate per order. Now I'm gonna do percentage of sale and I'm gonna give these people 10% for every order that they refer to us. And now we can further customize it. So we could exclude some products. So let's just say I have a product that I don't want to pay commission on. I'd click in here, I'd click specific products and there is actually one I don't wanna pay commissions on and that is this one here which is discounted. I don't wanna pay a commission on an already discounted item because that's just gonna eat into my margins. So we can choose that and that means that this is now excluded from any commission that affiliate might send to me. Now we can do some special product commissions here. So to enable this, we just click save and we're gonna click manage. Now this is a really cool feature. So let's just say you have a product you might be launching and you wanna reward affiliates for promoting that product. We can actually increase the commission at a product level if we want, as opposed to sort of this whole program level. So we can click in here and click add product commission. We might do it for a specific product and I'm gonna choose, I'm gonna choose this, uh, this duo here. We wanna sell two bottles. So if one of the affiliates referrals buys this product, I'm gonna actually give them 15%, okay? So they're gonna get a little bit more for promoting this product uh, to their audiences. All right, we're gonna click back. And let's keep going down and seeing what other options we have here. So this part talks about whether or not we wanna pay commission on sort of any additional things that are uh, in your order. So that might be product taxes, shipping, shipping tax. So I'm gonna turn those off because I don't really wanna pay commissions on those things. All right, so uh, a few different pieces here. Automatic discounts for customers, so we can apply a discount if they use the affiliate link. Uh, we can change the type of commission for new customers. We can even give commissions for lifetime. So let's just say an affiliate you know, drives a, a referral to your store and they buy from you. Let's just say they buy again and again and again. If we turn this lifetime one on, is that every time they buy, that uh, affiliate will get paid a commission on it, right? So you gotta determine whether you want to pay them just on the first order 
or on any trailing orders as well. So if you turn this on, you've got some options there around first commissions and you know how long that commission might last for. Now, I'm not gonna do that for this store. We can do different um, commissions around coupon codes and everything as well, excluding self-referrals. So you don't want them to earn commissions on referrals for themselves. If they buy you know, from their own referral link, do they wanna earn commissions? I don't think so. All right, so this is where we set up our payment methods. So we're gonna click the payment methods tab here. Now the payment methods are the way that we actually wanna pay these affiliates, right? And remember, we only pay them when they refer them as sales. So we're gonna choose how we wanna do that. So there's two options within UpPromote that we can use. The first one is what we call a manual payment. And that is basically you going and manually paying the affiliates based on the commission number that they have, right? And I'll, I'll show you that in a moment on my other store. Then we have this automated version, which is only for paid accounts. And it means that you could integrate, say, a PayPal account, and it can automatically pay into their PayPal account. So it just takes that sort of that workload off. But if you've only got a small amount of affiliates, you can easily do it manually. So I'm gonna choose the manual option for now. I'm gonna choose bank transfer, and I'm gonna click save. And then we're gonna go back to programs. We're gonna to scroll to the bottom. And we're just gonna make sure that the payment method bank transfer is selected. And we're gonna do default bank transfer, okay? And then we click save. Now this program is set up, we actually need to start recruiting affiliates. There's a few ways that we can do this. I'm gonna show you uh, the best ways. The first one is by creating a registration page. We need somewhere for them to put their details in. Let me show you how I've done it on one of my other stores. So I'll pop over to this store. You can see this program here is called the Coaches Program. I'm gonna click the registration link right here. We're gonna copy that link and it's gonna bring up a page like this. So this is a registration page that talks all about the program. So everything that we have written in the program is here. They just need to fill out their details and register for the program. I'll do that and show you how it works. And then the affiliate is going to get asked to verify the email address. This is to prevent spam. So this is the email they're gonna to get to verify. We're gonna click confirm the email address. It's gonna go through and confirm. We are all good. They're also gonna receive another email. They're also gonna receive another email that looks a little bit like this, that tells them we're waiting to verify their affiliate account. We'll go back to our affiliate program and we'll click affiliates. We now see this new account in here. And then what we can do is we can go through here. We can choose to approve, deny, you know, or we can log in as that person. We're gonna approve this account here. And then the affiliate is gonna get this email, which says, great news, your account has been approved. And then they get sent uh, a login to get directly into the affiliate program. So that is a super quick and easy way to get them started. Now to edit that, uh, that registration page, just over on the right hand side next to your program, we can click customize registration page. And in here you can go through and edit all the colors, the designs, basically everything that you want to do. Okay, so everything can be changed. Sort of uh, what you see is what you get on that editor there. You can change the benefits, the form, you name it, you can change it. So that's the first way to get affiliates enrolled, but there's a couple more. So if we click over to affiliates here, we're gonna see these options. We've got add an affiliate. So in here, we can manually add an affiliate into the program. So let's just say you have some friends or people that you work with, you can manually add them in. This is gonna send them an email and get them to enroll in the program. The other way is you can uh, enable a customer to be an affiliate. So we can click connect customers. We can go through here and we can connect our customer directly in to becoming an affiliate. Now, the other way is to use the outreach section in this app. Now, there's a couple of ways we can uh, outreach to people. The first way is via customer referral. This is a really popular method. So this is using our existing customers as our affiliates. So imagine you've got hundreds, thousands, tens of thousands of customers. They could all be affiliates by using this super simple customer referral. And in order to do that, you just click setup and you walk through the steps and get it all set up, okay? Uh, the other one here is the multi-level marketing. And this is where you can create an affiliate team. You can have affiliates, recruiting affiliates, driving your business, and you can just sort of see it compounding. The other way is you can use the UpPromote marketplace uh, that goes out there and then people can actually sell products on that marketplace. It's really, really cool. Once you're set up, you can then communicate with your affiliates. So you can manage your emails in here. You can you know, edit the emails as you wish. So directly in this section here, uh, we can also chat directly with our affiliates. So we go back here, we can see we've got this chat with affiliates option here. 
Now, once you have your affiliates recruited, we wanna give them some tools. We wanna to make it easy for them to refer your store. So over on the left-hand side, we've got another thing here, which is called motivation. Now in motivation, we can create some promotional resources. So we can create coupons for our affiliates. Uh, we can set some images up, so a media gallery, so some banners, some ads, things like that. We can even give incentives. So we could send out gifts to our affiliates to really incentivize them to refer to us. And then one that I really love here is bonuses. This is a really cool one. So basically, let's just say you have this like super great affiliate that's just sending through, you know, so many sales to your store. We don't want to just give them their 10 or 15% commission or whatever it is you're giving them. We can actually give them bonuses based on the tiers and the, the amount that they generate for us. So if you have a look at this, we click create bonus. Uh, we could call this the gold affiliate bonus, right? And so this is for people that are in sort of the creator program. And what we can have is that let's just say they give, you know, 20 referrals. You know, we could actually give them a, a bonus on this one here. So we could either a one-time bonus, we give a monthly bonus, quarterly, yearly. Uh, we could do, you know, current and future sales. And then we choose the bonus and we can give them a bonus amount. So we might want to give them $500 or whatever it is for reaching this target that we set. So we can really incentivize affiliates. So once this is all set up and we've got affiliates sending us sales, how do we track them and how do we pay them? So I'm gonna jump over to my other store where we do have affiliates actually driving us sales. So in this store, we can click referrals and we can see that we've got all these referrals that have come through here. And you can see that we've got the total sale that the person has referred to us. So we can see this one's a $61 sale, 68, 259, 92. Now remember, these are sales that have come through from an affiliate. Like I haven't had to do anything. They're just they're just linking to us, right? And for every sale in this program, we're giving them a $20 commission. So each of these sales is tracked directly to an order. And so we can cross check that order, make sure it's come through. Now what you can see is it's tracking everything that this person's putting through. And there's one here where this customer uh, did buy, but you know, something, you know, they needed to return it or get a refund or something. So we can see that refund came off here. And what's actually happened is we haven't needed to pay a commission on that one there. Okay, so we've got a couple of commissions to pay out here. So let's just say we wanted to do that. We'd click approve, it would go through and we'd be able to transfer the money directly to them. So they're all great methods to recruit affiliates, motivate them, do all those sorts of things. But I wanna show you a way to supercharge this and how to get affiliates fast, how to get people that love your brand and get them really engaged and driving you sales. So we're gonna go over to customers here and we're gonna click the little sidekick icon up the top. And we're gonna write in, create a segment of customers that have purchased two or more times. Sidekick's gonna go out, it's gonna look at their customers, it's gonna create a segment for you. We're then gonna grab these customers, we're gonna import them into UpPromote. UpPromote's gonna send an email out to these customers and say, hey, why don't you become an affiliate and they're gonna join our affiliate program and everyone is gonna be happy. So it's created this segment for us. We're gonna click that segment, can see them all in here. And then in the top here, we're gonna click export and we're gonna export out these customers. Export customers, and then it's gone to my email. Once you've received the email of the customers, we're gonna go back to up promote. We're going to go to affiliates. We're gonna click add affiliate. Now at the add affiliate section, we're gonna click import affiliates. This is where we can bulk import affiliates. Now it says, do we wanna send a notification to our affiliates? Of course we do, but we might wanna go and edit our affiliate templates here. So just go through your emails and just make sure that these all make sense for your emails. And we're gonna see a CSV file here. So we're gonna click download the sample CSV. We're gonna open up that CSV file. It's gonna look a little bit like this. We just need to delete a couple of columns. So we're gonna delete the customer ID column and we're just gonna delete all the other columns. So all we've got is first name, last name and email. I'm gonna save that. We're gonna go through and then we're gonna upload that file directly into here. And then when we click save, it's gonna send an email to all the customers in that file, encouraging them to join this affiliate program. Now, the great thing about having your affiliate program set up like this is it works with other marketing channels that you've got. So whether you're running meta ads, Google ads, SEO, content marketing, you know, email marketing, you name it. Affiliates is just another thing that just adds to that compounding snowball effect of getting sales in your store. And if you want tutorials on how to set up those marketing channels, I've got two here that you're really gonna love.